This course is brought to you by Appy Pie as part of our Academy series. Hello and welcome back. We will now be designing a LinkedIn banner, okay, for the social media platform called LinkedIn. So let's get straight into it. Now you can click more just here at the top, but for me personally, it's right here with the most popular ones which I use most. So I'm just gonna click this here, but for you to find it, if it's not on these top ones, just click more, scroll down until you find LinkedIn banner. Okay, so click that and let the page load. Okay, so here we are. This is where we will begin the design process for our LinkedIn banner. Now you have the layouts on the left here. You can choose any of these. They all look absolutely fantastic. And you have the main screen. This is where we will be designing. This is what will be uploaded to LinkedIn for your banner, okay? So let's get straight into it. First things first, I'm just going to rename the design LinkedIn banner. So it, that's what it says. As almost all the other videos, I have done it at the end. And now I thought I may as well just do it at the beginning. So it's already done, okay? So let's just scroll down until we can find a layout which looks good for us. Now I've already seen a few which look really good. This one here is really cool. I like that actually. Yeah, I think we're gonna use this actually as it's really quite nice, I like it a lot. So let's just change this to black brick and then it is motivation, marketing, mindset. So we're just gonna change this up a bit. So first of all, we're gonna change this to online courses, online courses, and then the second one will be 24-7 support. Oh, S-U-P-P. O R T, and then for the last one we will put twenty five thousand plus students. Okay, so now we're gonna have to make this text a little bit smaller so it all fits in one line. So let's just do that right now. Let's say about fourteen. Yep, that fits. Okay, so doesn't look too great like that. So let's make this box bigger so we can also make the fonts bigger. Let's have it almost to the edges, I think, there. There we go, that looks good. And make sure that's centered. There we go, fantastic. There we go, perfect. So that fits in very nicely. So we've got online courses, 24-7 support, and 25,000 plus students. So that means over 25,000 students, we can give you support 24-7, five days a week. So we're always available to support you, and we sell online courses. So now I might put a space after that, and after that, and I might also add the blackbooktraining.co.uk web address. Okay, so let's go to text and body text, all in lowercase letters, www.blackbooktraining.co.uk. Fantastic. Okay, so there we go. So let's just pop that there. And we're also going to want to change the font and the color of this text. Let's see what we can do here. So let's put this as that and put it white. There we go. Very nice. Now I think I actually want to put it as a slightly weaker font, very thin font I want. There we go, that's quite nice. Uh, let's see what it looks like, italic. There we go, that's quite cool. Yep, and then let's just put that down to about, let's just actually leave it there because if we move it down, we can't read the end of the web address. Okay, so there we go, blackbricktraining.co.uk, fantastic. So we have online courses, 24 seven support, and of course, 25,000 plus students, very good. Okay, and now we are going to go and click search and type in MacBook, as these are all the best images that we will be able to use for the background image. So let's just see what we want to use here. So we've got a few different options. So let's obviously go through some of them to see which one we like the most. Let's just have a look here. That's very nice, I like that a lot. Now remember, this is for LinkedIn. That's just something to note. So when you're using your images, just remember what it's for, of course, because if you put a silly image and remember for LinkedIn, it's a very businessy type social media page. So just remember that really. That's all I want to say. Just make sure you remember that it is for LinkedIn. Okay, so there we go. We're now gonna actually change this text at the bottom back to black because then it's actually readable. So we've got white text in the black box and then outside the black box, we have black text. So I think that looks very nice. I'm very happy with that. It's very basic, but very nice. Easy to make, but also very nice as well, <laughs> I must say. So let's just change the font a few times to see if we can find something a little bit better. And once we have, let's just leave it as that. There we go, fantastic. So we've got blackbricktraining.co.uk. Black Brick is of course the name of the company. Online courses, 24 seven support, and over 25 students is some of the details about us. So it's what we sell, what we can offer you, and what we already have, which is over 25,000 students. So that is absolutely fantastic. Now I'm just gonna try and change the image one more time just to see if this looks better. Nope, I don't think so. Let's leave it as this. So that is absolutely fantastic. We have designed our LinkedIn banner in under 10 minutes. It's super awesome, it's super amazing, and I am very happy with it. Hopefully you guys are too. If you aren't, of course, you have many different layouts for you to choose. I chose this one because I thought it looks nice, but of course you can choose any of these which you like the most, like I've chosen this one. This is the one I think I like the most. 
Of course, there may be one which is added later, which I like even more. But for now, I'm very happy with this. I think it looks very, very nice. Now you can also add your other social media usernames at the bottom for people to see it so they can follow you. But in this video, I'm not gonna be doing that. It's very simple, you can do that on your own. You can go to search, type in Instagram, like so, hit enter, use the Instagram logo, put it down there and then add your username next to it. But I'm not gonna do that. I've finished this design. I like it very much and hopefully you guys do too. So thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you learned a lot. I'll see you in the next one. Once again, thanks and goodbye.